Come on, guys, make some noise for David Lucas. Yeah. A lot of people think uh, that the hardest part about breaking up with an ex is like trying to get over all the memories that y'all had together. But I think the hardest part about breaking up with an ex is having to fuck somebody new with a condom. <laughs> That's the worst part. That shit suck. Like, I gotta start fucking with a condom again? Like, <laughs> and I got a big ass belly, so I only got one shot to put a condom on, you know? <laughs> After that, I'm like, you're gonna have to trust me. Like, <laughs> like I'm over 250. I can't have AIDS, right? Big niggas do not have AIDS. <laughs> I'm too fat. That shit passed me. Like. Wearing condoms suck, though. Wearing a condom is like putting on a glove and then going to wash your hands. <laughs> like, I can feel the water, but I don't feel no wetness, you know? <laughs> It's the weirdest shit in the world. Thank y'all. Wow. Week after week after week, you come in. All these other people pulled out of the bucket trying to do their best minute, and somehow you always come in and just well-written, smart, efficient words. You execute every single week. How about write, another time you, for David yeah, Lucas, everybody? <laughs> just incredible. You got to just get in the habit. You, I was... Thankful for Kill Tony because I had, uh, during that time, I had probably got in a stagnant place with comedy. So when I got this, I was like, oh shit, I gotta start, you know, because I don't want to do material that I already know. And then it's like, I gotta burn that. So I'd rather just like write some. So I just got in the habit of writing like 20 new jokes a week. It's great that you and have then, a habit other than hamburger habit. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. Well, no. You look like you got a habit of holding your breath. Oh, <laughs> come on. <laughs> That's actually Why, how y'all get the band from a weekend with Uncle Bernie's? <laughs> a weekend at Uncle Bernie's. <laughs> what it's called? Is that, that the BET version of that movie? <laughs> what's, the, what's the movie called? Starring Bernie Mac, Weekend yeah, at yeah. Uncle Bernie's. <laughs> <laughs> it's, just oh. week, it's just called Weekend at Bernie's, but it's somehow you made it funnier. Than, uh, <laughs> y'all got Bob Sag, and I watched this nigga grow it up. <laughs> yeah. How often do you get called the N-word, Bob? <laughs> that was impressive. <laughs> he just called you the N-word, and, he, and that's, a, that's a good thing. That's uh, a no, I'm fine with that. <laughs> he, had to, he had to fake like he wanted to be around the white people all day. He is a nigga. Uh, <laughs> no, I, I, I wanted to be black. I know you did, bro. I can tell your swagger. Everything about you say black. Like, I know you rap the N-word in songs and shit. Yeah. No, I, I, I don't say that word, but I, I do. Uh, Unless you're in traffic. <laughs> 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 that's that's funny, but no. That's the, the that's what causes traffic. <laughs> <laughs> what about the condom thing? Is that real? I huh? mean, would you wear a con? Would you when you broke up? Did you wear a condom? I hate wearing condoms, bro. But have you? You do. Yeah, I have. I hate it though. Like, have you ever done a benefit for Planned Parenthood? Because you could open with that. Yeah. Because that would you know that reinforces birth control. I, I mean, mean, do you I want? Do. do you have any kids? Yeah. What do you got? A girl. He's actually done. <laughs> <laughs> so the condom was not being used. No, no, no. I knew I knew it was going to happen. But I mean, shit. I lost my virginity like 14 years ago. So one kid, those are pretty good odds. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. What are you, like 20 now? Yeah. 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 One. So, so you were six? No, no, 29. I thought you said. Oh, you're 29. Oh, yeah. No, I'm sorry. I just imagined you being six, and that's how potent you are. <laughs> I mean, I am from the South, but I ain't fucked that early. <laughs> <laughs> what, what was that like out of curiosity? What was it like when you lost your virginity? How did that go down, David? Kind of like the first time you sat down to pee. You got a little bit of wetness on your balls, you know what I'm saying? A little bit drizzled to your ass crack, you know? So yeah. you're saying he's got no dick but giant long balls. But hang mm -hmm. Tony, Tony got an any. <laughs> okay, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, okay, David. Yeah, I'm the one with an When Tony out fuck of the a girl, he be scissor kicking. All right. Tony be bumping coochies. <laughs> what? You be bumping coochies. All right, well. Let me rub my pussy on your pussy. That's the name of a... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Have you been looking through my bedroom window at night? <laughs> this is just what I imagine. I imagine you, like, fucking a girl with Sesame Street on in the background. Yeah. True. Like sunny day, like I just, I just paint the picture of you 
fucking a girl with strobe lights or some shit though. Like, <laughs> no, you, you're you're absolutely right. That's how I f- I can't I can't get hard if Sesame Street's not on in the background. <laughs> I imagine you making animal noises like a tiger. Like, ah, girl, I'm a. <laughs> Again, that, that's actually a sound of me getting ready to have sex the other day. That's me. Here, watch. Do it again. There you go. See that? It's crazy. Hey, hey what yeah. do you do, bro? <laughs> Did you just ask Doug what he does? Yeah. <laughs> I'm just now learning white comics, man. Give me I'm a just, break. I'm just Uncle Bernie hanging out. Doug, Doug Benson, right? Doug, yes. My nigga. <laughs> Like, he's it, a real like, black. like your cholesterol, he's always high. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there you go. How's that? There you go. It puts the lotion on his skin. Yeah. You, you know the rest. Yeah. You just uh, had a weekend with Eric Griffin. How was that? Oh, uh, man, we sold out four out of six shows. Yeah, you sold out four out of six shows? <laughs> no, we. We, motherfucker. <laughs> What'd you sell out of? The, the food? <laughs> you no, we Eric. sold out four out of six shows, man. A couple, uh, shout, I can't remember y'all name, but shout out to the people that drove from Tennessee to come see me in Atlanta. Oh, that's cool. That were Kill Tony fans. Thank y'all. That's great. That's great. Yeah. Are what? you from Tennessee? No, no, no. I was in Atlanta, but they drove from, they drove from Tennessee to Atlanta. Where are you from? I was raised in Macon, Georgia. Uh-huh. Yeah. How was that? Did you say Bacon, Georgia? No. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that used to be our basketball team, Macon Bacon. Heck yeah. M- Macon was uh, shitty, man. <laughs> no matter where you live, it's the hood, even if you live in a good neighborhood, because there's, it's not big enough to like separate the bullshit from the good shit. So even if you're like, in a great neighborhood, some bullshit is like... Oh, like everywhere you look? What there's I'm saying, a hand to hold you, on to. You, you, <laughs> can, you, can be in a, you can be in a great neighborhood, but like the hood is like six minutes away. So you know what I'm saying? You like talk about this shit? Nah. You should. I should, yeah. I, I, I always responded well. Richard always talked about it in here. Yeah, I talk about it. Yeah, it's good. Yeah, it sounds like some great redistricting comedy. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. People love to hear gerrymandering humor. <laughs> 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 Here's my hunk on busing. I like it, bro. He reminds me of a black person. Sunglasses on in the club. Yeah, that's... That's what black That's people do. That's the way do, to right? go, yeah. yeah. So you and they call and where I'm from we call them hater blockers. I like it. So that way the haters <laughs> 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 Anybody ever heard that sorry? Anybody from the South heard about hater blockers? Yeah, all right. Uh, <laughs> you're the first black mind. person I've ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> Who are you? Ace Pet Ventura? Uncle <laughs> Uncle Joey. Oh. Oh! Oh! Hey, oh. <laughs> Oh, okay, I got it. <laughs> look at look at the drummer. Oh, uh, you the uh, the racially ambiguous nigga. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly what I was thinking. Yeah. <laughs> That's you actually said it. The pretty boy who you, used to wear all the leather jackets like the one Tony got on. He still does. <laughs> yeah. He's got them. This is oh, yeah, hey, yeah. this you know what I can do with this jacket on? I get to bump into a lot of pussies with my pussy. So, I mean, <laughs> it's very exciting. And you what are you going, wearing? Cooch you look like a cooch. Yeah, exactly. I wore the belt for you, dog. You're supposed oh, to... look at that fucking thing. Absolutely. Off white. Who fuck with off white, man? Oh my yeah, goodness. Right. I don't know. Fashion, what, fashion. I don't know what's <laughs> going on there. You look like an out of shape NFL referee though with that thing hanging down there. <laughs> Tony, you look like you wear vegan leather. Oh my god. <laughs> with, with 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 that belt, what is that? Caution tape for after you commit a crime? That shirt looks like a billboard for Cool Runnings. If it was worn by a guy that's never ran before in his life, I can't be roasting with this thing. I got jet lag, man. Is, how did you find a belt that's l- bigger than your waist? How do you have all that slack? It's long enough for you to hang yourself off. <laughs> Plenty of room. <laughs> You're just jealous that I can hang myself, David Lucas. <laughs> if you ever tried, you'd have to do one of those sad, like, doorknob leans where you just lean into it and your, like, butt's I, on the ground. You just I have had to, to jump off a bridge. <laughs> yeah. Go to Gay Bridge can hold me up. Maybe it can. I got a joke about that. I said I tried to commit suicide one day and the ceiling fan came down. <laughs> 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 wow, that is. Are amazing. you on the Jamaican blob sled team? <laughs> you look like one of the niggas from Enron that killed himself. All right, you dress I, like you. I apologize for that one that I did say. I couldn't help it. Yeah. <laughs> it's Jamaican all good. You look, blob yeah. sled. Yeah, right. <laughs> you look like a stay-at-home dad. <laughs> You like you gotta take <laughs> your kids to soccer practice. Oh, I thought you were gonna say I'm gonna stay at home until I'm a dad. 
he <laughs> looks like he Doug looks like Sugar Ray Charles. <laughs> Wow, Uncle Joey joining the fray. That is incredible. I, ne- I didn't know Uncle Joey could roast right, like that. Right. Watch mm- out, I'm coming for you. <laughs> <laughs> what else you got, Doug? I just, I just still can't get over you calling him Ace Pet Ventura. <laughs> 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 oh, you look like you lost your lips in a mouse trap. All right, this that is motherfucker ate the cheese. <laughs> 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 now I get it. <laughs> <laughs> David Lucas, you did it again. Unbelievable yeah, set, unbelievable interview every single week. 